Hi everyone. All right, so it's official. We have got a look into the future. We can see what the future of visual content creation is going to look like. Epic Games is at the forefront of introducing us to some incredible uh, technology. They just released a tech demo that's called Lumen in the Land of Nanite. It's a real-time demo that's running live on the PlayStation 5. So if you're a gamer, you get to see some next-gen uh, gameplay as well. But in this video, I want to talk about how Unreal Engine 5 can benefit us as 3D artists. So during this tech demo, Epic Games basically showcases their two new technologies, which is called Lumen and Nanite. So Lumen is a fully dynamic global illumination solution that immediately reacts to scene and light changes. So we can see it over here. And what this basically means is lighting is going to look a lot more realistic. There's going to be this beautiful bounce lighting in our scene. And we no, we no longer need to bake any lighting within our 3D scenes. And Nanite, on the other hand, is a virtualized micropolygon geometry that frees artists to create as much geometric detail as the eye can see. So within the tech demo, they're actually using film assets that have been photo scanned and they're using that within Unreal Engine and it's all running in real time. So these assets contain millions and even billions of polygons, which I think is absolutely incredible that everything is being able to run in real time. And this technology called Nanite is allowing us to do that. There's basically this section within the tech demo where they encounter the statue and they even mentioned that the statue was exported straight out of ZBrush. It's got a ridiculously high polygon count of 30 million polygons or triangles or something insane like that. But then they continue to blow your mind even further by telling you that as she walks into this room, that exact same statue has been duplicated uh, about 500 times, which means that the polygon count in this room alone is in the billions, uh, which again is mind-blowing that all of this gets to run in real time. So what does this mean for us as 3D artists? How can we utilize Nanite technology? Just the simple fact that we can bring a extremely dense mesh with a high polygon count directly into a game engine, just that alone is a game changer. This also means that workflows are going to be streamlined. So having to worry about stuff like optimizing a mesh, you know, doing retopology, I'm sure that it will probably still matter to a certain degree. Probably if you're doing animation, I mean, I don't know, unless they build a tool that can rig extremely dense meshes, then retopology and all of that is still going to matter within the game world. But they are basically telling you that you'll be able to bring in these extremely dense meshes directly into a game engine. So according to what they've said about Nanite, Nanite geometry is streamed and scaled in real time. So there are no polygon count budgets. There's no polygon memory budgets or draw count budgets. There's no need to Make details to normal maps or manually author levels of details or otherwise known as lots and there's no loss in quality so you can see in the scene over here with this incredible draw distance that the level of quality and fidelity that's been produced within Unreal Engine and these assets is completely mind-blowing. So this is certainly going to speed up our workflow as artists. The fact that we can bring this into the program is really cool, but I still think that retopology and stuff like that is still going to matter. I mean, what if we need to texture a object, right? Uh, we still have to do retopology. We still have to do UV unwrapping if we want to get, you know, the best texturing results. Uh, but I guess the, what they're trying to highlight here is that we can bring in these really dense objects directly into a game engine, which of course is revolutionary. You cannot do that right now. You cannot bring in these crazy dense meshes directly into a game engine unless you want the game engine to chug and uh, completely destroy your frame rate. So this technology called Nanite is definitely going to help us as 3D artists to visualize our worlds a lot quicker, eliminate some of the you know, repetitive tasks of doing uh, re topology and all of that. Maybe if you, if you just want to visualize your scenes within a game engine, you can just bring it directly into Unreal Engine. So it's going to be a great tool for 3D artists. Now, let's not forget to talk about Lumen. This is probably the best example of the Lumen technology. You can see how the light just seeps into this room and it basically illuminates the entire room. So we're definitely going to get much more realistic looking lighting in our scene, which I think is an absolute game changer. I think this is what games in general were missing is really dynamic and realistic looking lighting. So Lumen is going to be the perfect solution for creating fantastic looking lighting within our 3D scenes. And as they say on their website, 
website um, it says artists and designers can create more dynamic scenes using lumen for example changing the sun angle for the time of day turning on a flashlight or blowing a hole in the ceiling and indirect light lighting will adapt accordingly so lumen erases the need to wait for light map bakes to finish and to author light map uvs so it's basically a huge time saver when an artist can move a light inside unreal editor and the lighting looks the same as when the game is run on console so this is going to be really cool even for people that are doing films adverts the fact that you've get, you're going to basically have access to realistic looking lighting that you can just move around in your scene and it updates immediately that alone is a game changer and it's going to be extremely beneficial to all of us as filmmakers as 3d artists and i'm super excited for this technology all right guys so definitely go ahead and watch their tech demo watch it in all of its glory and high resolution it's beautiful uh, epic games has really showcased some incredible uh, visuals over here that actually blew my mind and i just wanted to talk about how this can benefit us as artists i'm really excited to get my hands on this technology i'm actually going to start learning unreal engine I'm, i don't plan on making any games but i want to use it as a tool for visual development uh, maybe even for some animations or filmmaking in the future and I just think that this extensive tool set is really going to come in handy. And if you're a 3D artist and you're watching this, thumbs up. It's a very, very exciting times ahead for us. There is no better time than right now to be a 3D artist. I am super excited, guys. I hope you share the exact same excitement as me. I was just smiling from ear to ear when I was watching this video. And I can't wait to get my hands on this in 2021. Alright, so stay tuned for some more videos and tutorials or just random videos like this uh, with me blabbering about awesome new technology that gets me really excited. I truly appreciate the support on this channel guys and as always, thank you and goodbye.